So this is the main event. So I got the adapter for the Chinese to the English one. So let's see. Oh my god, I'm like so nervous. I saw a spark. Oh, it turned on. No fucking way. Oh shit. I said no way. It's it turned on. Nice. Whoa. Hey, it turned on. What the fuck? <laughs> Dude, look at this shit. Dude, look at this shit, Jamal. How complicated is this? I don't even know where I put it to where. Yeah, that's pretty fucked. Turned on, wow. Okay. We should maybe take a picture and then like continue the next game. Guess who's back? Hello. Okay, so guys, I finally built the printer, right? But we have some issues. I kind of messed up the wiring, so I have to adjust that. And once I do that, I'll show you guys the finished product. We're almost there, guys. Just a couple tweaking. Okay, guys, I fixed it. Well, I don't know if I fixed it, but let's see. Let's see. Let's Does it mean I'm gonna post it? I got it. Yeah. So it's smoking. It started smoking again. That's weird. I don't know why. It's fucked up. Why would it smoke? It's well, like plastic, so the plastic's burning. I feel like it might be one of the wires too. Yeah, Wait, it is one of the wires. Man. It is one of the wires. It's Chinese made. No, but that doesn't, that doesn't matter. Maybe it's deep water, dude. No, man. Cut the wire. It wasn't like the surgery. Hey guys, so I'm just here at the Spool 3D. With, uh, sorry. I'm Richard. Richard and then Derek. Derek. And then, yeah, so I'm just here uh, basically getting some wires and some components for the final episode for building a 3D printer. So, yeah, it's really cool showing you guys around just these printers around here. I thought this was pretty cool. They got all wide selection. This is all for sale. Do you, have you guys heard of the M1 carbon? No. The new, it's like, it's like, it like, put, like it, they use like uh, light and oxygen to project an image on this like a layer of liquid. And they melt the plastic and like close up the plastic or whatever the projection is. And it's like just one way to do it. Yeah, it's actually, oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, yeah, it's exactly similar to that. Yeah. How much is this one? So yeah guys, they also got all kinds of filaments. PLA, gray 228, look at that. All sorts of filament. Spool 3D. Sorry, where is this located? It's on the 40th street on one southeast. 11929 40th street southeast. So you guys, yeah, 40th street, 1129 <laughs> southeast I think. I'll put the address in the video description. But yeah, it's, I thought it would be really cool to show you guys around. You guys 3D printed this? This arm over here? That's so cool. <laughs> I just went, that's cool. <laughs> finally guys, I finally have all the parts. And guess what came in the mail yesterday too? Okay, look at that. I opened it already. Obviously, I don't see it. Yeah, it's but look what we got. We got the mosh fit. Oh yeah, baby. We can finally fix the 3D printer. I also bought some uh, these connectors and stuff like that. Basically, uh, everything you need for it. So, oh my god, are 
you serious? There's a two pin connector. Okay, we'll figure it out. Okay, well, uh, so there's my 3D printer over there sitting in the corner. And yeah, and also I, I kind of want to explain to you guys why I have been uh, why I've been haven't made a video in maybe two weeks and I was I was supposed to release a video every week every day but the reason is my grandma actually passed away unfortunately just about two weeks ago when I posted that video on YouTube and it's been really crazy since then we've been like we just had the funeral last week and we've been really I've been just trying to help my family and just basically organize stuff and it just been really hectic in my life and plus my broken arm and yeah I just I've been also this thing took forever to come in the mail so I uh, yeah so I finally uh, can get start to get to uh, going and we can finally post episode 3 so that's great so I'm looking forward to it let's uh, let's build it okay guys so I I'm just looking at a video right now I don't really know how to install this obviously as I don't know how to install the majority of the 3D printer shit. But basically what I'm doing is I'm just gonna yeah, just turn this around here. So what I'm doing is so this is the MOSFET. So what this does is regulates power coming from my house to the 3D printer. Because what was happening was this part over here was it was going too much current was going in and it was burning out my motherboard and it's, it started to melt so I turned it off instantly. So what I need to do is take these components off right here and then uh, rerun the wires in here and then take this, run it through the motherboard. So the wires from the hotbed and the extruder go here and then uh, the wires from this go to the motherboard so it regulates it. So hopefully this will solve the issue and uh, yeah, let's see. Okay, so now I'm, this is the, these are the extra wires I'm cutting. So to, so this is the mother, the main power is going to the mosh pit. Now I'm gonna run the power to the 3D printer. So I need some extra wires for that. So let's just cut these out. By the way guys, uh, you, you, the uh, Spool 3D, eh? I didn't even know about that. They had a store in here in Calgary. So that's actually great. And, Anytime I need some free supplies, I can definitely just go there and over there. Yeah, that was pretty nifty.
step is, so the wire from the heat bed is negative and the positive gets installed here. I guess that's it. Now I should be able to plug everything in. Should work. Hey guys, here's for the two moment. Okay, so the Z3. Oh crap, I forgot where all the things are. Let's turn it on. Hey guys, so the blue light is on in the thing. The red light is on there. Now let's just wait and see if it will heat up. So what would happen is you see those uh, right underneath the red line, red, red, uh, those two screws. They would basically heat up. That's from the hot bed. The thing. I think I did it, guys. I think this. I think we fixed it. Okay, now let's. Let's see now. Quick settings, boom, off. So guys, I'm pretty sure I figured out the issue. I had the end stop for the X and Y mixed up. So let's see if that will help. Okay. Well, I'm just I'm just doing some things. Right oh yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, we fixed it. Okay. Now, let's see. Bad. Pre preheated. Really. It's heating up. So that's one of the issues I was having. It wasn't heating up properly either. So let's see uh, what happens. It looks like it's heating good. 
Everything is great, guys. We gotta figure it out. This is perfect. We can finally 3D print. Okay, I'm gonna, once it heats up, I'll get back to you guys. And yeah. Oh, look at that. Can it do it? Can it do it? I think it's doing it. It's never done this before. Oh my god, yes. No! No! Did you see that? It went to 177. like it's not it's going down and then it just goes up I just don't get it I don't really get it yeah so guys this is weird I plugged the fan in and it almost went to 190 so that's really weird some more research and let's see what they tell me. Okay, well, there's, it does reach 190. Let's plug the fan in. That was weird. I really moved. I moved the hot heat bed. And it, it. Now it's back down to here. Get the fan out. Upstairs, and as you can see, it's heating up, but that's because I have the fan plugged out. So, I honestly don't know what's wrong with it. I'm sure you guys want to get to the desired temperature, but basically, um, I don't know what's wrong with it. I'm, I need some help online from you guys. I was hoping maybe someone could let me know so. Yeah, I'm sorry I don't get, I'm not going to be able to print anything for a little bit, but I have to figure this out. It heats up, like, I don't know, there's like no flickering with any of the lights. It looks like the connections are all solid. It even heats up. Look at that. I 
as soon as I move that thing there, then this thing jumps. So I move the extruder, and this thing jumps. Now look, look, it's at 190, right? Well, not 190, but almost there. I have the fan plugged out right now. my connections. I don't know, like, everything seems to be good. Yeah, so, I don't know what you guys think. I apologize that I didn't, I'm not going to be able to print anything. But, uh, yeah, I should have it fixed. Put episode 3 up, but, look, look at that. And then this, this is too, it's like crazy. We'll go with the, the little thicker side. Nice.